For me, I have plenty of episodes to watch. For you, good luck. You have a lot of watching to do. Hey, I'm sports broadcaster Scott Braun, and this is Shameless Promotion. Today we're talking about local MLB games with DirecTV and how I use their sports tab to keep up with live games and scores. Shamelessly promoting the best way to watch sports? Count me in. When I do have some time to just kick back, unwind, and when it gets closer to when I should be going to sleep, that's when I like a little bit of comedy, a little easy watching. Family Guy really fills that need for me late night, easy viewing, and often picking on current events, which is definitely a big thing for me too. I like to relate everything to the real world. When I need a good laugh, Stewie Griffin is always there for me. He's always the smartest guy in the room, even though he's, I think, perpetually three years old. Family Guy is now on its 21st season, so for me, I have plenty of episodes to watch. For you, if you've never seen an episode or haven't caught many, then good luck, you have a lot of watching to do. My nephew is now a Broadway star, working at night on Broadway and then on the weekends hanging with his uncle Scotty and we'll watch maybe a little Peppa Pig and I can learn about what the British pigs are up to and he'll tell me stories of his friends learning from Peppa to jump in puddles. Jumping up and down in If I'm talking to a baseball player or interviewing an athlete and they have a little kid, I might drop a Peppa Pig line or just be like, oh, Peppa, right? That's cool. So I'm a big Office fan. I've watched every episode. When it came out, I watched every episode. I love Jim. He's very relatable. But what really makes Jim Jim is the way that he has his bits with Dwight. There are basically two schools of thought. Fact. Bears eat beets. Bears. Beets. Battlestar Galactica. Bears do not. What is going on? I'm trying to kick back. I'm trying to enjoy a good laugh. And for me, I very much look forward to watching Saturday Night Live when I'm not watching sports, whether it's live or I record it. It is definitely appointment television for me. Aubrey Plaza was in it and any skit they did, she immediately adapted to the character that she was in. Another for me would definitely be biopics. These are stories that involve a ton of adversity and they're real life, which often real life is even cooler than a movie or you can't even script it. Music has definitely been my best escape. Since music's a huge part of my life, naturally I'm trying to learn about famous, legendary musicians through these biopics. It's weird, there's 24 hours of the day and somehow I feel like I'm usually watching about 25 hours of sports every day. And on a nightly basis, I'll be flipping to all the different regional teams to watch what's going on. With DirecTV, you don't have to compromise. And with the My Teams and Team Selector feature, it's even easier to find your team's game, whether it's playing right now or in the future. So stop compromising and Start watching the games you love. Check out DirecTV's sports features.